Rosetiers, stand by. What an unlucky draw for the Black Widow team. The Rose Boys, very experienced. Three, two, one. Activate. Though this is gruesomely destructive, those Black Widow legs would seem very vulnerable, and Hypnodisc is just waiting. Come into my parlour. Uh, so Hypnodisc to the spider. Well, that way, did it? And Hypnodisc waits. And the spider chops down with that swinging pickaxe, controlled there by Chris Arnell, a self-employed mechanic. Look at Hypnodisc. Come on, come to me. Just maybe feeling out the Black Widow tentacles before deciding how best can I actually go in and get my disc spinning to its destructive maximum potential. They, they can't quite work this out, Hypno Disc, and I think they're maybe worried about strands of the web getting caught up in the disc. Well, I've been worried. I don't think so. A little side-on attempted assault. Did it cause much damage? We'll wait and see. That did! Eight legs down to seven. Look at this, they waited their moment. The chopping ability of the spinning disc. And already Black Widow here. Counting down, the ref bot sees that Black Widow is about to be gobbled up by Hypnodisc. And Incy Wincy Spidey will be climbing no more. Out goes the Widow. And Hypnodisc wants to come in now. But it's won the battle for a bludgeoning blow before leaving Black Widow to the husbandry of the house robots. And Black Widow, taunted and teased by Hypnodisc, it seemed to me early on there. They just wanted to wait for their moment. A torched spider. And a gruesome end to a first and valiant effort on Robot Wars for the team from Brampton. <laughs> well, they're still flapping away at the roses, as we've said before, are blooming on Robot Wars. Come on, let's hoist the spider into the air. That took some doing, and I think that's the first time our floor flipper has failed to hoist a robot at the first attempt. You're talking 200 kilos, mind you, there. It didn't fly, first of all, balanced precariously on a web of its own making, perhaps. And the Black Widow eyes will stare no more.